What's going on YouTube? Uberman here. Wanted to do an update review. Already did one on my Samsung exploding washer. Seems to have a lot in common with my now returned Samsung Galaxy Note 7. Don't buy one of these. Now let's focus on this thing. December 24th, 2015. The exact same day that I got this, I got my Bissell steam cleaner. I'm still very satisfied with that thing. That thing is great. This thing, on the other hand, just broke um, just a couple days ago. This is now October 18th, 2016. So we are two months shy of this thing making it a year. Um, this is the Bissell Power Glide number 1642, I do believe. Yes, model 16. I don't know if you can read it, but model 1642. And as you can see, this is the Power Glide. It's a pretty awesome looking vacuum cleaner, and quite honestly, it has worked very well up until the bearings in the brush went out. Now, quite honestly, I've never seen this happen before, especially um, under a single year. And just a little bit of update information here um, I clean the brush regularly, as in, there's a little bottom panel. That you can just take off. I pull the entire brush assembly out and I clean, I, I cut literally like with a knife. I will cut hair and little stream, things like that. You know, nothing major, but little things that tend to build up. I cut them off and then I clean the bristles. Um, I do this so that it continues to, you know, clean my carpets well. Um, <laughs> and, uh, you know, out of nowhere, out of the blue, the uh, roller down here just locked up. And as you can see, I'm trying to turn it. That's that's everything I got. It won't move. The brushes are locked up. I took it apart, tried to figure out what's going on, and the bearings have seized on this side of the brush assembly. So, I go online, and I'm looking for, you know, a brush. Or better yet, just the bearings, because you don't need the whole brush, you just need the bearings for it. Guess what? Very difficult to find parts for this vacuum cleaner. Um, I was able to find a brush but it didn't say specifically that it was for this model, and the bristles were a different color. They were like purple. But it claimed that it would fit this model. It wanted like $40 for it. Are you kidding me? So, I'm going to, uh, you know, make sure to put a post in the original video warning people of my issue with this, and uh, hopefully, if you're thinking about buying one, this may give you something to think about, because there's no reason why in 10 months this vacuum cleaner should have been broken. There's absolutely no reason that vacuum cleaner should have died this soon. So, with that being said, hope this video helps you out in making a purchase or <laughs> non-purchase decision when it comes to the Bissell Power Glide 1642. As always, like, comment, subscribe, and be safe out there.